Danny Diamond is a relatively young photographer operating out of the East Coast, mainly Connecticut, who in his career has put together an amazing and unique look. Anytime you see an image, you can instantly tell if it's a Danny Diamond shot or not because he's created such a signature look in such a short amount of time. I think a lot of photographers kind of experiment. They're not sure what they want to do, so they kind of go in a whole bunch of different um, ranges and go down different avenues. Danny found a very specific process for him and honed it down to a really tight workflow. We wanted to make a tutorial on natural light with Danny Diamond because when you look at his images, you can't really tell how he, how he does it, how he achieves his look, but he's crafted such a signature style that's so sought after that we wanted to really explore and learn his process. The biggest thing that struck me about Danny's natural light photography is his methodical approach. Over Danny's career, he's crafted this list of steps that he follows religiously and is now second nature to him that allows him to get the absolute best photos for his retouching process. Danny's post-processing is really pretty interesting. When you look at his raw files, they're underexposed, they're not you know, perfect coming out of the camera. It's all part of his workflow. When those images are done, they just have a vibrancy. None of the post-processing looks like it's pushed too hard. It looks, I don't know, somehow he's blended what needs to be done in post with making it look natural like the expression coming off of the person. So he gets a natural expression and he puts it through this post-processing gauntlet that all comes out with a really inviting portrait. It's right on the money. When you talk to him about his early work, those images took a long time to retouch. I mean, he would spend hours and hours getting there. And he was able to kind of pare that down and figure out the key components that work and then put that into a uh, kind of a quickly moving workflow. So he's able to really knock out the images that he, exactly that he wants without having to waste enormous amounts of time in post-production. Now that I've seen Danny's process from start to finish, from the pre-production to how he works and engages with models, to the locations that he chooses, to everything that he does in Photoshop, I know for a fact that I never would have come up with this process on my own. And I think that's what's most exciting is that we've gotten to break down his process and now we get to share that with you. I think this tutorial is incredibly important for anybody who wants to do natural light portrait photography. Danny's process is clean and it's concise and it's tailored and it's really going to help anybody who is kind of getting their foot in the door and wanting to build their signature style and build their business. This will give you a rock solid foundation to make that happen. I think I'm most excited to release this tutorial to the photography community because it's going to open up a lot of newer photographers' eyes on the simplicity behind great portraiture. When you go outside and really learn what natural light can do for you, you're going to be absolutely stunned at the final images. This tutorial is exciting to release because there's so many people who are interested in what Danny does. He's got the chops, he's got the skill set. People are gonna learn so much from Danny. I can't wait to see what people say once they've downloaded it and gone through the whole process and started to implement Danny's workflow into their own workflow. I think it's really gonna be a game changer for a lot of photographers out there.